Good morning, everyone. It is Saturday morning, and I'm doing what I normally do on a Saturday morning. Um, we're sitting here watching Food Network. I really like the Pioneer Woman's um, at-home shows. I, I just find them better than her regular shows, and I love the kitchen. And I'm kind of disappointed that I was up in time to watch these, and they are all... Face. Yeah, I see your face. <laughs> and they are all about spicy oh food face. today. I see your face, buddy. And so, you know, if you've watched any of my videos, you probably know that I hate spicy food. Just hate it. I can't, I just can't tolerate it is what it is. And so we're just sitting here hanging out, me and Luciano, waiting for our Amazon fresh order to come today and see what else the day brings. Xavier's at work all day today. So it is me and the kids. He is working bell to bell. That's what he calls it from open to close, and uh, yeah, just gonna hang out here. Right, buddy? Look at Luciano's here. Yeah, Luciano's here, huh? Yeah. Uh, Okay, I am so excited because my Amazon fresh order came. I know it's not that big, but I ordered it this morning and I was able to choose, it was like seven o'clock and I was able to choose like between 10 and 12, which is pretty good. Sometimes lately it has not been that you could even get same day deliveries. So quickly, I'll share what I got. Bananas, kids love bananas. I got cilantro, I'm probably gonna make some salsa this week. I only got one avocado. Um, it's pretty hard. I don't know what I'm gonna use it for, but I do like avocado. We got gold potatoes. I'm gonna make some sausage egg balls. Like think of, I don't know, Denny's breakfast balls, potato balls. And then I got two loaves of bread, white one the kids like and wheat Xavier likes. I figured I would give the Happy Belly brand a try. You can see I got like all Amazon brand stuff pretty much. Um, tortillas, we are out of tortillas. I've never tried the Happy Belly tortillas and we are out, so I figured I would give these a try. I have had this breakfast sausage and I like it. And I've had, I've had had? I've had the Italian sausage, the mild, and I like it too. It's not spicy or anything and I think it is delicious. Um, looking at my mayonnaise, it looked like I needed one for like a backup and I was excited. I don't know, I wasn't excited. I just <laughs> I just figured I would get one um, as a backup. Uh, my daughter likes pierogies, so I purchased them for her. And uh, three things of frozen potato-like things, onion rings, fries, and sweet potato fries, just to stock the freezer with. And then I got this chocolate hummus. I purchased this last time that I did this order. It was so good. I loved it. Um, my daughter tried it. She did not like it. She said it had a weird texture, but I think it is so good. And then um, I just redid the spice cabinet and I don't have any Italian seasoning. So I figured I would pick this up. This thing was only like 59 cents. I thought that was a good deal. So all this was like $35 because that's what it is for free shipping and uh, I needed a few things, specifically bread, because we are totally out and I have to make Xavier sandwiches for tomorrow and then uh, flour tortillas. So yeah. So here is my new spice jars. I purchased these jars and I picked these ones because they had these labels in there and I didn't have to buy them separately. And I thought they were really cool looking. Um, so I did a 25 pack, I think and uh, I was able to get everything I had in. And then I had these ones that I've had for a while, but I labeled them because they didn't have labels before. And then these are a few that I didn't put in jars because they don't have like a jar that says seasoning for all the things or everything bagel seasoning or even like the umami seasoning. So I figured I would keep those in their jars for now. Leave it like that. I'm just gonna need to get um, new like containers to pull out. Probably something similar to my silverware ones and uh, 
pull them in and out that way for now at least those ones were like two bucks in the drawer and then uh yeah so i think 25 of these was like i don't know 18 bucks got them on amazon okay so i got another package at the door this is my spring cause box i feel like i ordered this forever ago i have an annual subscription to them because in the last box they kind of like hey, we'll give you this for free if you sign up for an annual subscription. And so far I've liked everything that I've gotten out of them, so I figured I would. But I did cancel my FabFitFun box when I saw what was gonna be, is it the summer box? I think it's the summer box. And I just knew I wasn't gonna be happy with those things. So let's quickly look inside here. They must always give you a postcard. This is a gigantic book, right? So every, I always want to talk when I'm making these. So every box came with a bag and you got to choose the color. So this is the color I chose. It's actually pretty big. It's got a side pocket for your bottle of wine. Two bottles of wine. Oh my gosh. You can fit your bottles of wine inside. Look at this thing. Someone likes wine too much, right? I don't know, I like this bag. I'm not. I'm not opposed to it. Provides three meals, feed. I like it. I think it's cute for a bag to carry things around. Then I picked out this. This is, I know I picked this. I was going back and forth, going back and forth. And then I ordered a pair online from Amazon and they were like junk. So when I saw this one, I said, you know what? I'm just gonna get this. These are blue light blackers they definitely oh they have some glare and they definitely change the color of my world like I feel like without them I'm in like a a cool toned world and when I put them on everything is like warm at tone I'll, I'll give them a try the other ones, the Amazon ones kind of were hurting my eyes too. They just totally felt like junk. I cannot wear these though on camera. Oh my gosh, that reflection is horrible. Okay, so we got, oh, a couple more things in here. This is Age Defying Nail Treatments, a Power Couple Nail Duo. I need them because, look at this, can you see it? Where's the camera? I don't think you can. Focus. My nails are like, peeling apart so we have um, an age-defying nail treatment and oh this is another one so two age-defying nail treatments I will give these a try here is another box this is oh I remember this kind of I think I do now that I see it I remember it, but I do not remember that this was gonna be in here what is it, Lauren's us here watching? This is a, like a cord, or a, what do they call it? A technology, Catherine Tech Organizer Roll. So it's a good place to put your stuff in, cords and things like that, and then just keep them all together. This is from the Glass Ladder & Co. You know, it's vegan leather because it's um, from the cause box. We got a pocket here with a $35 price tag. Catherine Tech Organizer, there's a code to save 30% on your next purchase. I think it's pretty cute and uh, I'll use this to store some of my cords because People in this house, not Lorenzo, but people in this house steal cords like crazy. Xavier brings them to work and loses them. My daughter takes them. They're just always missing, so I like this too. Okay, what else we got? This is Three Ships Lip Treatment Kit. Hydrate and exfoliate. There's a vanilla lip exfoliator and a buttercream hydrating lip mask. This is the vanilla. I love vanilla. Mm. Smells like frosting? Yeah. Yeah. This vanilla smells really good. Mm -hmm. Can you see it without seeing me? 
Oh, I like that. And then this is buttercream. 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 This one's smooth. It's not chunky like that other one. I can't smell anything, can you? And this says it isn't made in Canada. So we'll give these a try out tonight too. And one more thing. This is the Stress Check Sleep Spray Fast X Fast Acting Vegan Sleep Spray with lavender, chamomile, and essential oils. Oh, it smells like lavender. Smell? I had a Bath and Body Works that I had forever, and I spent last weekend cleaning out the garage. Like, that's my happy place is uh, to organize and clean out that garage. And I had one of these kind of things in there from Bath and Body Works that I finally threw away that I had from like when I lived in New York and I moved to Arizona in like 2008. So that was probably no good, right? So yeah, there's everything in this box. I think it's a pretty good deal. I'm happy with it all. I like my glasses, I like my bag. This bag's really like well made. You like it? And I like my cord case. So yeah, cause box, check it out.